again. <coughs> that's so and that's so annoying. All right, listen. This time, this is the run. That was a warm up, okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah. What's up? What's up? Wow. So how was uh, how'd you do with the impossible spell card? I got to the. Did, uh, you got about halfway through it. Nice. Yeah, it's fun. I like it a lot. I should return to it, actually. I just, I, you know. Hey, if you stall out tonight and you just can't can't get it done, then, well, have a palate cleanser, you know? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, impossible spot card's nice because you don't lose a lot of time on a failed attempt. It's just a few minutes. You can take as much or as little time as you want. A few, a few minutes is a... Deal you breaker. only lose like, a couple seconds, honestly, if you fuck up in there. It's like a, a minute at most if you're uh, if you're taking a real long time on something. You're taking a monster shit. Wait, what? No, that's not right. <laughs> not um, even close. <laughs> what the fuck you talking about? What's this boy talking about on the telephone? Alright, I think this time I'm going to forget about the UFO here for now. Because there's not a whole lot I can do with it. Yeah. Yeah. You can get a piece. Just tell him to go away. Get out of here, I don't want you. You can get either a piece here, or maybe you can get two when you, if you leave it around later on. For later on, you know? Yeah, I didn't quite do it totally wonderfully, you know? But, because, like, I lost one red UFO. But, like, all in all, still not. Still not doing too bad. Give me that. Give me that beautiful red UFO. Thank you. Where's that beautiful red UFO? Feed him! Feed him and Show blow him up! Show that, me that beautiful UFO footage. That beautiful red UFO. Papa needs a biscuit. That's what I say. What? Is that going to be the next t-shirt? <laughs> Papa needs a biscuit? Yeah. The, that's Papa the, needs a biscuit like that's a good catchphrase. over a dumbass red UFO and there's no explanation for it at all. <laughs> I think that's a bankable cash range. You should totally go for that before somebody else takes it. Yeah, Papa, Papa needs a biscuit. Needs a biscuit. Trademark that shit. How about on the front, Papa needs a biscuit, and on the back, show me that beautiful red UFO. Yeah, that's, that's, a million, that's a million dollars right there. You just yeah, made a million dollars. Papa needs a biscuit is over the UFO, though, and the biscuit's on the back with the show me that beautiful red UFO. Show <laughs> me that beautiful UFO. Nazarin, stop shooting at me already, okay? It's over. All right. Now, if only you could just tell him to do that, you know? I'm done now, thanks. I'm good. I'm done shooting. Let's just stop. I thought that's what the bomb button was for. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> that That's kind of your just, I don't want to do this anymore option. <laughs> Let's stop. Still Not really feeling up to it right now, sorry. Yeah, the... Can't, can't do these crystals right now, sorry. We're, we're, we're done. You have, uh, failed to use any resources so far, which is a good thing. Yeah, yeah. I just really gotta be smart about using bombs, meaning that, like, I should use them. Yep. Yes. Ideally on patterns that you can't handle non-bombing. Right. This is advanced uh, shoot 'em up tactics. Right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Using Speak. bombs or not. The the balance of the life force and all that crap. What? Oh wait, give me yeah. that UFO. Give me that UFO. Give me that beautiful red UFO, baby. Oh dear. Come on, Papa needs a biscuit. Oh. Wait, wait, wait. that's okay. That's okay. Catch you on the rebound, on the flip side. No, I won't, because there's a... Yes, I will! <laughs> that was... I, I, I did a very, very, very risky thing there, but it worked out okay. A risky thing that worked out means it was a good idea. Gotta risk it for the biscuit. Mm-hmm. That's what they say. Yes. That's, that's, that's a good, like, hoodie shirt thing. Actually, we should get the kick. Turning out all the shirts tonight, damn. Yeah, Toho oh, biscuit themed shirts. Yep. Let's feed Toho the U. Let's feed that cap. beautiful UFO. Eat, baby. Eat my darling. Oh dear. 
Extend, that's the word. The word we like to see here in Toho. Toho stream. Picked up here. Red. Yeah, oh, okay, well, yeah. one red is okay. All right. Now, what, what should I call her? What's her name? That's uh, Kogasa. Kogasa, okay. Yeah, that's, that's Western name ordering, right, yeah. All right, which one's Parasol? All right, Parasol Shawl. Da, da, da. Parasol Stars. Hmm. I don't know if I needed it, needed it, but I did it. What the hell? Who cares? Well, let's look at the footage. Yeah, you didn't, you didn't need that, but it was probably safer than Sorry, honestly. Mm -hmm. uh, the UFOs are in this game to give you resources. You assemble three red UFOs for pieces of lives. You assemble three green ones for a bomb and a piece of a bomb. Or the blue one, which is for score. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I haven't been actually reading the chat that uh, thoroughly. I should have been doing that. That's nah, supposed to be my job today. Whatever, no, it's okay. You don't have a job, okay? Wow. No, I mean, like, Thanks. you don't. I mean, you're like, done. no, I, I meant, like, hey, you know, you, you're a pal. You're in Discord. Like, you're not my employee. Hand in your keys. I'm not paying you, is the yes, place, what I'm trying to get. Us. fired by me. <laughs> no. God damn, I thought I had a stable position here. You do, like, okay? Deep industries have been, like, experiencing serious <laughs> no. playoffs. No. No. God damn it. Who else have you fired, or is it just me? <laughs> I can't afford to. When is Diabetes gonna t lose his job? <laughs> oh, he's like years ago. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Today is actually like one of the first days I saw Diabetes stream in a long time. Yeah, right? I saw that. The, like, the past randomizer. How is that? I know I haven't played that yet. Really fun. You, uh, you have to know more about the game than most people do so it'll take a lot of practice but there's a lot of tools that people need to make it easier to do that mm -hmm. pretty fun though That's cool. recommend it. uh the toughest bean as deep as you want to make it be in my case incredibly this is unnatural and not okay for honestly for the most part hmm? uh the question i answered it uh Okay. <sighs> Humans, fairies, etc. Okay. Ask me about having read literally every single piece of text <laughs> he's ever written. Is that... You've read every piece of text Zoon has ever written? Uh, that has been translated into English, yes. Um. Unofficially. Spell card bonus, okay. Alright, so far not a bad not a bad run, I mean, you know. Pretty solid. Whoa, hey, hey, hey. I kinda lost I kinda lost track of my uh, focus button for a minute there, but gained it back just in the nick of time. Ah, shit. Okay. That's okay, we're okay. Still not dead. Get it, got it, there's that beautiful UFO. There's that beautiful UFO. Whoo, yeah. boy! Yeah! Mm, that's dodging, baby. That's dodging, baby. There you go. That's the good stuff. It's that's not, top quality. Not. That's top shelf dodging. Thank you, thank you. Whoa! Oh, okay, well, that's alright. That's not too bad. I mean. Frankly, I've got, like, enough extends that I don't feel too bad about any of what just happened. Yeah, no, you're still fine. <coughs> that was a tactical death, you know? Yeah. It was on purpose. Who, are, who is this person now? Uh, this is, it, um... Ichiren. Yeah, Ichiren. Uh, Ichiren Kumoi. I actually I had a second where I forgot her last name. I knew it was Ichiren, but... Hmm. This pattern, I'm like, eh. I could, like, go either way on this pattern. I'm not wonderful. At, like, sometimes it's, like, very easy, and then 
occasionally, like, it, there's, like, some fast-moving, like, rainy stuff that's like, whoa, wait, wait, where did you come from type of deal, you know? Yeah. yeah. The games as a I'll whole use uh, one, slower bullets. All the stuff that falls down. Yeah, and I usually don't need to death bomb that, but, you know, whatever. Better a death bomb than a death. Yes. All right. Fish smash. <coughs> fish smash. Fist smash. Or fish oh, man. smash. Fish smash would be so good, though. Fish smash would no, be, no. actually. Yeah. Fish smash is the next game. <laughs> hmm. Wait, was that 13 or 14 that had the fish in it? Uh, that was actually 12.3, so yeah, next game. No, no, I mean, I mean the the mermaid girl, whatever her name is. Oh, that was fourteen. Sorry. Uh, that um, was fourteen. Wakasagi Hime was uh, from fourteen. I was thinking of the unnamed giant catfish. That was one off. Scolding from a traditional old man. Oh yeah, this one's the weird one that I. I'm. I might take a death. Yeah, I'm not good at this one, unfortunately. So let's skip it. I shouldn't say I'm bad at it or anything. I'm just sort of like, eh, about it, you know? Yeah, I'm just kind of not into it. Mm. I'm good. Yeah. I can skip being scolded. All right. <coughs> Excuse, me. <coughs> Excuse me. The Here next main series game will likely come out in like a month, actually. A little bit over a month by the next comic hit. All right. Now the part. This is the first of two stages that are really going to decide things, you know? Yeah, stage four. And five, really, you know? Uh, I'm going to bully Beef into playing that one for real when the full game comes out. Which one, 16? Yeah. So he releases the one a year, right? Uh, he usually doesn't release them once a year. It's usually like once every year or two, every two years nowadays. Mm. Uh, it has been a once... Toho game every year. It's just not, necess not eh, necessarily one of the mainline series. Yeah. And uh, occasionally he takes years off. Like 2015, I think, didn't have any. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Get up, get up, get up. There was one year where he released uh, two music CDs in a row rather mm. than any games. Yeah! Hey, good work. Thank you. Not good enough until... Somebody show me. That beautiful red oh, UFO, please. Uh... 2016 was the year off. That's right. My bad. Uh, that's when Dr. Latency's Freak Report and uh, Nameless Bar Old Adam came out. Dateless Bar and Old, old Adam. I love, love the title Dr. Latency's Freak Report. It's very good. Aww. Man, you've done almost perfect uh, resource gathering here. Mm. Almost perfect. You're, you're almost capped on lives. Yeah. And the death bomb. <clears throat> All right. You know I don't like this boss now. Yeah. I know you don't like Marasa at all. No. She's one of my, well, really three. Um. This is the wall, though. This is the wall. Uh, Zoon is actually relatively private with his uh, personal life, so we don't know how well off he, he is. He probably is pretty well off did all the merchandising that he does, but who knows. Okay, thank God. All right. Dragging Anchor is usually one of my big problem cards. Yeah, pretty good. So you can use a bomb, capturing all the cards, man. Ugh. 
stupid, stupid, stupid reason to use a bomb, but, eh, whatever. You know what? Hey. <clears throat> if I have to take a death on Deep Vortex, I'm not going to feel terrible, because that's not the world's easiest uh, pattern, you know? Mm-hmm. Get back here! Wah! <laughs> no. Nah, she won't. I'm good. She's good. They yeah. actually do generally try to get into your way, which is yeah. nice. Instead of just trying to avoid you. Miles is good out here. <laughs> Alright, Phantom Ship Harbor. Uh... uh... Phantom Ship Harbor, I don't know if it's RNG, but it feels RNG-ish, because, like, sometimes I feel like... Eh, I, I don't know if the... Uh, I don't think the anchors are always aimed at you. Uh, you. I don't think so. It's it just might the... be slightly RNG whether or not they um, come out like that. <laughs> All right, guess what time it is. It's Sinker Ghost. What's up, everybody? Stage 4 survival card. Yeah. Take it uh, slow. One bomb. Take it slow? <laughs> like, I mean, matter. yeah. You can't take it any faster than it is. It's impossible. And also, if you spread out too much, it makes it a lot harder to dodge. No kidding. I honestly, I'll be honest, I'll be I'll honestly be honest, I don't have a great strategy for Sinker Ghost, but... Okay, one death on her is not, is better than my usual, so... One death on any of the bosses is really good. <coughs> Flat. Real solid. <coughs> yeah. <coughs> now it's time for my next, uh, big problem area. Stage 5! Uh... I hate it. Good I old love show. it, Oval Archery. It's very good, but also I hate it. I'll make sure that Beef gets this later. Yeah, it's a good image. Somebody drew you as a Toho character. <laughs> well, as a yokai. Nice. Ooh, wow. There was no frilly dress or hat. So they yeah. all eventually become Toho characters. It's cool. <laughs> they all. All the streamers. No, all the all the like mythological yokai creatures. Eventually. Eventually you become a Toho, whether you like it or not. Uh, missed a UFO and I didn't have to. Well, whatever. Give me that beautiful red... Uh, give me that beautiful red UFO. Thank you. Duh. Okay, well... Ah, bitch. Okay. Which boss is this? Oh, yeah, this is... Show Kodamaru. This is not show yet, though, right? This is Nasrin oh, yeah. again. This is just Nasrin again. Yeah. This is kind of like your introduction, in a way. Because she has, like, this pattern, which I forget this card, which I forget the name of, but it's a lot like Radiant Treasure. Which uh, is... It's Greatest Treasure. Yeah, this is... Yeah. She's like a, a an interesting sort of show warm up this time around, you know. Yeah, she does use the curvy lasers as the first thing to kind of warn you, but they work differently and they're not like they don't really curve, honestly. They have like at the start, and yeah. that's it. And then there's this, which is similar to Radiant Treasure, but much much weaker. Yeah. I would check this shit out. We can curve it now. I would almost say she has like kinked lasers, you know, in a way. Yeah. King's lasers, that's a a way to put it. They straighten up at the end, yeah. Mm. They don't curve at any meaningful point. Alright. Here we go. It's showtime. Great. <coughs> you know what? Fuck your curved lasers. The garbage. No, Kavadaya, beef is working on 1cc. It doesn't mean that you don't die, it just means that you don't continue. 
Right. Yeah, one CC is one credit clear. Credit referring to basically a um, an arcade continue. Mm -hmm. Uh, a a no death one is called a no miss clear. Mm -hmm. Nah, no curve this blazers. Be kind of a nightmare for most of the games. No miss clear. Yeah. You'd have to, yeah, good. that's like mastery of, yeah. Okay. That's master of these games, flat. Oh, yeah. Fun facts. Uh, Radiant Treasure is, in fact, likely a reference to uh, famous shell shoot 'em up Radiant Silver Gun. A no game kidding. By Treasure. They're uh, the Icar predecessor. Yeah, I, you know, I know of Radiant Silver Gun. I never actually played it. I believe that's the one where B Attitude for Games comes from. Uh, one of the most incredibly, thoroughly, and lovably uh, Englishy games there are. Oh, I can't I believe I. It was on purpose, too, which is the best part about it. What's this? Oh, Vaj, most valuable Vajra. I never, yeah, I, I never learned how to pass this one. Let's just be honest here. So. There is, um, it, it's always the same. This is one that if you know it, exactly what you're doing, you understand how this one works, and you can always get past it in the same way. It's just That's right. You press the bomb button and it ends. That's a way to do it. <laughs> I yeah. I mean, I was so I practiced this a bunch last night, and like I just. You know, I never really got Vajra. Still, I'm. Sh I'll have to, it's like one of those things. I feel like I have to watch the solution. Yeah, no, that's that's better, honestly. If rather than trying to figure it out and taking a bunch of deaths on the way, just just bomb it. Yeah, especially since that's one that, like I said, it works the same way every time. If you watch it being done, you will understand how it works inherently. You know. Mm -hmm. I understand how it works, and I still can't do it <laughs> consistently. Yeah, it I involves. Just, I uh, just bomb it. <laughs> It involves unfocusing um, at the correct time. All right, we got the beautiful red UFO. You gotta move real fast. Whoa, that was close. Base invaders. Yeah, Base invaders. Uh, I'm wondering, like, yeah, you know what? I I feel like uh, I, I feel good enough with six lives, I guess. I I don't want to jinx it, but like, I also am just like, yeah, getting you that. You don't have to go for resources at this point. It's just like the risk of getting that, like, because there's, um, there's also, they're pretty sparse on the red UFOs at the end here. It's like, pr yeah, you know, pretty it's, much there's it. only a handful of uh, flashing UFOs left. It's mostly just score ones. Yeah. And I'll just take the full power here. It stinks, but what are you going to do? I'd rather not die. Five lives, one more. Well, it's a big power item or a full power. There's no, you don't get any um, lives or bombs there. I mean, Wait, I, I will remind him that the bombs do not work on the fi this character's final spell card. Yeah. I know. Yeah. They're still I, useful because they give you breathing room, and that card is particularly rude. But yeah, it's we'll a particularly rude final spell. Yeah, I. It takes so long to, you know. Mm -hmm. Bombs on her in general, I find seem a little anemic, but maybe I'm crazy, or maybe it depends on the pattern. Honestly, it depends on the pattern. Some it's bosses also weird. have a thing where they actually take more damage as the card goes on, so using a bomb at the start is kind of a waste. Ah, uh, I didn't know that. Just That's to prevent you from like bombing instantly and destroying the card before it even gets to get started. Mm -hmm. Alright, you've got six lives total here. 
I mean, it's 12 bombs. Yeah, but... <laughs> don't... Don't overestimate my ability to choke. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. This pattern... I... It shouldn't be hard, and... I always take a death to it like that, though. But, I mean, we killed each other with it. Um, Star Maelstrom... I feel like skipping. Even though you kind of can't skip it totally with one bomb. It's not hard, and I have to death bomb. Alright, this card is... This is where she starts moving around. Yeah. Yes, this is the uh, moving around cube thing. These two non spells are actually a real rude. They should be spell cards, in my opinion. Yeah, this one in particular, it, it probably should be a spell card. Yeah, this is rude. <laughs> it, it's complex enough that it really just kind of should be. There are some, there are some bosses in these games that have really, really rude, hard non spells, <sighs> though. Mm -hmm. Devil's Recitation. What's this? All right, I like this one. This card is cool. It is a cool card. It is uh, based off of an attack from the 05, Mystic Square. I should probably try the other PC-98 games sometime. They're not bad. It's, they just feel weird. 5 is honestly the only one I can really recommend at this point. Unless you're extremely curious. My, I uh, am. How, like the older games were, because it just it's it's the closest to like one of the modern Toe games. Even then, like, does it have auto collect? I don't think it does. I don't, I don't, I don't think, think it does. Later on, was this Saint Nico's Air Scroll right? What? Saint Nico's Air Scroll? Huh? What? Oh, Superhuman is the uh, the hard and lunatic version of this. Okay. Oh. That's the only one I remember this by. It's um. These were bomb wastes, but I like I kind of lost track of where I was, so I'm like, ah! <laughs> you know. I mean, yeah, you're still better, heading there with them. Better safe than sorry. Yeah. This, this, is, this is a full life bar attack. Yeah. And also, it, it, it takes reduced damage from bombs, so... Here we go. What's this one called again? Flying Fantastica, great. Um, Flying Fantastica is really rough. This is the one. Yeah, I know. Those are not going to be as effective. I don't have any yet, anyway. Flying Fantastica doesn't look like it's that hard until it starts to get really hard. It's, yeah, it's like... You start out like, I can handle this, and then it's like, oh boy, this is getting a little nuts. More layers get added. Yep. Yeah. Oh dear. Uh, whoa, that was kind of lucky, I won't lie to you. Okay, one death. Remember to use those bombs. They won't hurt her, but they will clear out some of the bullets. Give you a little bit of breathing room. UFO 1 CC! Congratulations hey! on beating Dr. Lon's challenge. Ha ha ha! Let's go back to chat. Um, even an extra life, damn. Yeah, you've been consistently clearing these with one extra life. Hey. Yeah, so I think for, I mean, practice obviously, but like I had to just go all in on the UFOs. You know, yeah. like that's really awesome.